Hello and welcome for another soap review. Today I'm going to review ES Bjerg um, shaving cream, bamboo lemongrass. It is a sample I got here. Um, I think this is an Austrian handmade artisan soap. I could swear that this was a Norwegian soap by the name, but uh, I think it's an Austrian soap. I just checked it up and I uh, so it said uh, Austria, Vienna and so on. Um, I didn't find any ingredients list when I googled it quite fast there, but in the description it's uh, supposed to be a vegan and then all natural soap, but I have not seen any ingredients yet, but I will continue to search for it later. And I will post it in a link in the description below here. Anyway, this is a cream. And it has a medium, maybe a little bit below medium, strong scent of sweet, uh, creamy lemon. That's all I can say. Very nice scent. Um, we will use the badger brush on the vintage handle. Silver tip badger. And the shaver is going to be the Gillette Slim by Both Year Razor. Rhodium plated with a Gillette Nasset for first use. And I will finish off with uh, Karl Lagerfeldt EDT. I hope you all had a good Christmas and you could celebrate them. Celebrate it with the people you love. I have about um, two days of growth. I'm gonna just apply the cream like this. We'll see what's happened when if it's gonna explode in ladder or not. That would be sufficient enough. Little bit slick on the fingers, but not so. It doesn't explode in an immediate creamy thick leather. Even though I took quite a lot of cream on my face, as you could see. Actually, this feels uh, very thin and not good at all. I'm gonna pause the video and rinse it off and start again. Okay, here we go again. I uh, decided to bow ladder it in my scuttle and I have put about two or three times more soap than I usually do. So if this doesn't make the trick, nothing will. And then we have the brush here. It ladders up quite fast here. It was very strange. It felt so light and thin on my face. I didn't like that feeling at all. And actually it was not difficult to rinse it off either. I don't feel this thick layer of oil on my face. But the fact is that it's already 
peeking here. So it was no problem at all to bow ladder this one. In my opinion it looks, I don't have my glasses on me, but I think it's not any bubbles in it. We go with the bow ladder, it was a very long time ago since I did that. Okay, here we go. Yeah, we got a different result here. And this is the kind of uh, soap that feels very, very light on your face. It's not that heavy lotion-like leather that you can get from some kind of soaps. In my opinion, there are three kinds of face feel you have these very very light ones and then you have the medium one and then you have the really heavy I would put this maybe in the middle feels better now We are there. There we go. First pass. Let's see how the glide and residual is on this soap. The glide feels very nice. This Nasa blade is one of my favorites as well. It's a very sharp and smooth blade. <clears throat> At least for me. Very nice first pass. Good glide. Let's see how the ladder holds up for several passes here. holding up very good as you can see it's not thin it feels very nice this soap is a little bit on the pricier side it cost 22 euros dollars for a 100 gram. It's 
a bit more than three ounces for you Americans. Very, very good residual slickness. <coughs> I start to get uh, surprised in a positive way now from that bad start. Really nice. Third and final pass. Very nice leather indeed. It's holding up perfectly. Doesn't dissipate at all. The nice sound of sultrus. It's not bitter, it's uh, slightly sweet, but not overly sweet. Just perfect. It's probably some chill oils, so it's a very natural sound. I have to shake that up later. Yes, it's a massive residual slickness, very, very good. And this is the first time I shave with this soap. So um, I expect um, post shave feel to be fantastic because it's all natural ingredients. But if they are not, or if it's not leather, I will write it in the description. I'm happy so, I'm gonna rinse and I'll be back. Back for the post. Of course I'll take my little 
Humphreys, which is here first. And nothing else on the face. Now we finish off with the roller felt. And I'm ready to go. Except I'm not going anywhere tonight. I'm gonna be home. Quiet evening, Friday night. Just relax after work. I don't have energy for anything else really. This soap, very very good soap indeed. Uh, all natural ingredients and uh, your skin will probably feel very good. Uh, medium to weak scent of a uh, bit sweet citrus. Um, pleasant scent. Um, is, it, is this soap worth the money? Uh, no, it's not. Uh, I have several cheaper soap. They cost 16 and 17 euros with uh, all natural ingredients that is as good as this soap. But this was a really good soap. So if you're interested to try this soap, you will not get disappointed at all. Um, very good glide. And you saw in seconds I bowled up the ladder perfectly. And it was very slick, very, very slick soap without uh, leaving your uh, skin full of a thick layer of oil. It was just like they have uh, put exact correct amount of everything in the soap to make it just perfect. Uh, very, very good soap, very good performer. Um, well, that's it. Hope you enjoyed. And I wish you all a great weekend and take care out there and I see you soon. Bye bye.